Many people are under the impression that salvation is like a contract where you comply with certain conditions, you do certain things, and if you've done that, you have salvation. If you say the sinner's prayer and you belong to a church, you believe in Jesus, then they believe that you are saved and they can prove it from the scriptures. That's not true, dear friend. Salvation is knowing the King of the Kingdom of Heaven and accepting Him as your Master, serving Him and obeying Him, getting into a close relationship with Him, doing His will. That is salvation. It is knowing Jesus Christ and through Him, God the Father. Because there is no other way to have access to God the Father, who has given everything to Jesus. All power and all authority has been given to Him. And He will decide who goes into heaven. And He will say to many Christians, many people who believe in Jesus, and believe that they are saved. Some of them preachers. Some cast out demons. Others healed the sick in his name. Did many powers. Jesus will say to them. Go away I never knew you. Because they never got into a relationship with Jesus. Jesus said my sheep know my voice and they listen to me. And they will not listen to strangers. Dear friend, if you do not know Jesus, and Jesus does not know you, you do not have salvation. Jesus did not come to condemn the world, but to save the world. But the words that he spoke will judge us in the last day. If we do not obey his words and do what he says, and we don't have salvation, we are doomed. You are only saved if you walk in a close relationship with Jesus every day. And he gave the invitation to all mankind. He said, follow me. And whoever wishes to follow me must deny himself, pick up his cross every day and follow me. Only disciples will go into the kingdom of heaven. Only people who obey Jesus and do his words. Nobody else. Before Jesus ascended, he said to his disciples, All power and all authority has been given to me. Go therefore into all the world and make disciples of all nations. Make disciples of all nations baptizing them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, and teach them to do all that I commanded you. That is His command. And He sent His Holy Spirit to guide each and every one of those disciples who obey Him. If you do not obey Jesus Christ, and if you are not baptized in water, and if you have not received the gift of the Holy Spirit, you do not belong to Him, friend. Because those who do not have the Spirit of Christ do not belong to Him. They cannot listen to Him. They cannot follow Him. That is what salvation is. It's being in a close relationship with Jesus all the time, every day. Following Him and doing His will. Do you know Jesus? Does He know you? Are you in that close relationship? It is not a contract, dear friend. You're not going to cash in on a contract and say, according to this scripture and that scripture, I'm saved. 
either Jesus will know you and welcome you in because you have been in a relationship with him, or he will say to you, I don't know you. Go away from me. I never knew you. Do you know Jesus, dear friend? And do you follow him every day of your life? Do you know his voice and do you listen to him? Do you know the Master? And does the Master know you? May Jesus bless you.